All right, all right, all right. This is Intuitive Empress coming to you with a another reading. This is the Soulmate and Twin Flame reading for my bull gang, my Tauruses, my fellow Tauruses, because I am a Taurus as well. I thank you, Tauruses, who have subscribed. Um, I thank you for coming to the reading. If you're a new subscriber, thank you for trusting me with your readings. Uh, you have been awesome and phenomenal um, to me. Um, the channel has, has grown greatly um, in the time frame that I have been on YouTube. Your comments have been awesome. I do thank you for coming out. I do want to let you know that I have started putting the extended readings onto Patreon. So we're going to do a reading here and then we're going to extend. Um, and if you, uh, if it resonates for you, you can come over to Patreon to find out more about your soulmate and person. So let's get started. I do say if you are new to the channel, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you are um, not new to the channel, please like, comment, and share out this reading. With no further ado, we are going to go into the reading. I just wanna shuffle one last time. All right. Holy Spirit, heavenly angels of heaven and most high God. Come into this message. Heavenly angels of the most high God. No other spirits are welcome. And we have two cards up. Oh, we have a whole bunch of other cards that flew out. I'm going to take them. All right. It says. You never leave my thoughts. I want you in my life, but I'm afraid. I replay our conversations over and over. I'm afraid that you don't love me. I love you more than you know. I'm going through a tough time. <laughs> That's coming up in everybody's reading. Because it is a tough time out here. With all that's going on, it's a tough time. So your person, I feel like you're separated from your person. You never leave their thoughts. They want you in their life, but they're afraid to let you in their life. Because they're afraid that you don't love them and they don't want to be hurt. They replay your conversations and I'm thinking maybe your last conversations over and over in their mind. And they love you more than you know. They have a tough time because there's tough things going on in life, but also they're going through a tough time because they love you okay i'm gonna get some more messages on this because wow time wow taurus it's only three minutes it was three 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 on the phone when i looked at that let me see something See what 333 means. I have my angel numbers and I'm going to go through that because 333 is a significant number. course it's not like right on the top three 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 is the angel number holy spirit is assisting you with whatever you're working on you're in great hands discover your higher purpose and this person is part of your higher purpose 
This person is part of your higher purpose, Taurus. You might not feel that way. I know how we are. We're, we're stubborn, especially if somebody act like they don't want us or say they don't want us. We're like, well, we don't want you either. We don't need you. <laughs> I'm pretending everything is okay. You came closer than anyone. You mean the world to me. I feel like a ticking bomb. Let's get some divine truth, some hidden truth. Divine masculine and feminine. The wind is knocking us down. It's funny. That's been happening today. There's a fresh wind coming in your relationship. <laughs> Blowing the cards. There's a fresh wind in your relationship. One more shuffle. All right, I'm gonna move these. I think Spirit is telling me to move these. Okay. Messages for my Torians. Messages for my Torians. It says, I trusted you. I can't reach out. I hide my feelings. Do I still have a chance? I can't get enough of you. Any other messages? I don't know how to feel. That's too many, way too many. I would do it all again. I can't do this. I let you down. I'm in a committed relationship. Wow, Taurus. And on the bottom of the deck, it says, I saved your texts and messages. Wow, Taurus. I'm sorry this energy is like this. The other readings were so different. So this person feels betrayed because they said, I trusted you. They can't reach out. Why? Because they're in a committed relationship. They want to know if they still have a chance. They said they hide their feelings and they don't know how to feel. But they're in a committed relationship. They said they can't get enough of you. That they can't do this. Now, I don't think they're saying they can't do the relationship with you. They can't continue to be in this committed relationship because they can't get enough of you. 
I'm conflicted on this message and I'm going to be real because I am the one that I say I'm not one for breaking up a happy home, a relationship. I'm not. And I'm still not. I do believe that relationships do go sour. I do believe that divorces happen. But I also feel like if this person really feels like that their relationship is over with the committed relationship that they have, they need to end that. They need to end that cycle and be completely free and clear all of that energy up before they start something with you because they were in a committed relationship when they came with you some of you live with this person some of you you know was dating this person exclusively or you thought exclusively and the whole time they had a wife a husband or a baby mama a baby daddy somebody that they were living with somebody that they were in commitment with and they started having feelings back for the baby mama, the wife, the husband, the baby daddy, and they left. So if they don't clear this energy up, then you want to go be going around and around and around and around in circles. So we're going to go and we're going to extend this. I'm going to go into a preview of this extension because I want to see. I'm just being nosy. Yep, I'm going to be nosy and I'm going to go into this. And I'm going to get some Oracle messages. Wow, Taurus. Wow, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. I'm going to have to take a break after this. I'm going to do the other messages tomorrow. This is heavy. Got some things flying out. All right. So it says, let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Ooh, that's a turn. <laughs> this person watches your social media. I moved those cards and that was, was there. It says, attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work. We need some extra light because it's starting to get dark. All right, so we have deception. 
someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. And it says a false self mask. Wow. You deserve love, Taurus. You are lovable. We have honeymoon. At the bottom of the deck is reconciliation and love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Someone from your past is returning in your life. All right, so we're gonna go farther into this, into the extension, because I thought we were gonna get some more clarity, but it just got a little bit deeper. So we're gonna dig deeper over an extension. And if this is where we part ways, I will see you next read. But if you come over with me into the extension, welcome over. Because we're going to dig, we're going to dig into this. This this is deep. I was not expecting this to be this deep. But thank you so much. And I will see you next read. If you don't come over into the extension. Bye for now.